In our Islands We Play Toddler Workbook Series, our workbook animals week one, we have pets. Now a few fun things to do with a worksheet such as this is to first ask the child to colour in and decorate the page here. Then for a bigger child you can ask them to cut the animals out themselves or for a smaller child assist them with cutting the animals out. What you can then do is you can take some cups, either normal plastic cups or if you have throwaway cups. Then you place the different animals underneath each each cup. It works to have three. But you show the child, say, look, I'm putting the bird here, the cat here, and the bunny here. Now close your eyes, and then when you open them, can you tell me which cup had the bunny again? <gasps> it's this one. And then for a bigger child, you can maybe even mix the cups up while they're looking and not too fast and then ask them now under which cup is the bunny now it's under this one and then if you use throwaway cups you can then always turn your cup into a bunny or a cat or a dog or a bird it's a fun activity to help your child to decorate their own pet cup what you can then also do is you can use sticks you found outside and on the page attached you can ask your child let's build a, a nice cage for our little birdie and maybe the child can first draw the bird and then paste the six as a cage on top and then you can decorate with feathers anything you find around the house now these are just a few examples with a worksheet such as this but remember to make it fun and interactive and on the level of your child's learning so enjoy learning with your child. In our islands we play toddler workbook series. Our workbook animals week two we have farm animals. Now a few fun things to do with a worksheet such as this is after you've allowed the child to follow the lines on the page either with their finger, with a crayon, um, pasting wool on it or using paint to follow it is to make shadow puppets. Now you can either um, for a smaller child assist them or a bigger child let them cut them, the animals out themselves and then you can paste it on sticks and then with the sunlight you hold the animal and make a shadow and then for a smaller child you can maybe ask can you use chalk and on the floor draw a circle around the cow I made on the floor and for a bigger child you can ask them can you trace the lines of the cow on the floor or if you don't want to work on the floor of chalk you can always make the shadow over the white page on the side and even at night you can use these cutout animals with a flashlight to make shadow puppets on the wall and then you can ask the child to mimic the sounds of these animals as you go along now these are just a few examples of a worksheet such as this but remember to make it fun and interactive and on the level of your child's learning. So enjoy learning with your child. In our I Learn Through Play Toddler Workbook series, our animals workbook week three, we have wild animals. Now a few fun things to do with a worksheet such as this is you can use chalk and then on cement outside you can draw these shapes. And then you can maybe ask the child, you see this animal? This is a cheetah. A cheetah is fast. It's in a rectangle. Now can you make fast like the cheetah and run around the rectangle? And do you see this animal? This is a tortoise. The tortoise is slow. It crawls on the ground. Can you maybe crawl into the oval? And can you crawl around the oval? And then you can ask the child, can you walk like a wild animal either to a shape around the shape or into the shape then what you can also do is you can use the jump rope and you can ask the child can you maybe put the jump rope in the shape of a triangle or you as a parent can put the, tri the jump rope in the shape and then ask the child can you walk along the lines of these of the jump rope or jump into it and remember it's fun to make it 
linked to the animal so you can say can you make like an elephant and stomp into the circle and can you make like a deer and quickly jump out of the um, circle now these are just a few examples of worksheets such as this but remember to make it fun and interactive and on the level of your child's learning so enjoy learning with your child in our I Learn Through Play Toddler workbook series, our workbook animals, week four, we have sea animals. Now, a fun thing to do with a worksheet such as this is to make it into a game. So you can take your dice and then you set the rules beforehand. So for example, you tell the child, if you throw a four, we are going to draw four dolphins on the page here. And if you throw a three, we are going to draw three shells or look in magazines for three shells. And then if the child throws two numbers, for instance, a four and a three, you can tell them now we have completed the first part of our board game. So we take a string and we paste it on the line. And as you do this, you teach your child about numbers, um, fine motor either with throwing the dice or connecting the strings and then you can teach the child about the various sea animals you discuss in your board game and for instance if the child throw one you say okay now we are going to make like this one dolphin either the sound or you can make the child mimic a dolphin or you can maybe again look in magazines for pictures of dolphins and tell them more about these wonderful sea life creatures now remember to make it fun and interactive and on the level of your child's learning. So enjoy learning with your child.